Hello everyone. <clears throat> uh, this is just a short video asking for some help. Uh, I took apart the uh, motor that I got from the treadmill a while back that I showed in some of my previous videos. Okay, what I found out is uh, apparently it's an induction motor so it uses electromagnets to go around the coils so on and so forth and it's got the brushes uh, you know brushes go on that part right there anyway I put DC current to it and no matter which polarity I use it still spins the same direction and that was the test of an induction motor it uses AC or DC current blah blah blah, blah. okay now I've read what I want to do is make this a permanent magnet motor uh, to test some uh, Peter Linderman stuff and or make uh, a permanent magnet alternator out of it. Obviously it's got the coil set up with all the uh, ferrite rings around it to create uh, a very good magnetic field. Okay. All that. I'm sure you guys are all familiar with electric motors. Blah blah blah. Okay, here's the two leads coming out here. So, what I've been told is I gotta cut out all this wiring, all these strands here, and place uh, some ne neodymium magnets around this, uh, around the bar, somehow. And if that's correct, before I start tearing all this crap out, I need to know if that's right, and I'm doing it right. I mean, look at these awesome bearings on the sides, too. Suckers will spin forever. Anyway, I need help on that. Uh, just a short video on anybody out there watching who knows about uh, induction motors and how to turn them into permanent magnet motors slash alternators. Uh, please let me know. All comments are... Welcomed. Thanks a lot, guys. Bye.